Oh, sorry. Hello, folks. You're just catching fire three, and I actually figured out what these coordinates lead to. Uh, from an image. Let me just get it up. Um, I should get it up soon. I can't. I don't know where it is. So really what it does is if you put it in Google Maps, it'll show up far away. But if you press satellite, instead of have it like a map version of it, zoom in all the way to it and it'll show you something. But if you want if you wanna um which I'm gonna call it uh see it for yourself what it is. I'll keep the camera on these coordinates for a while. Uh, so, if you want to pause. Actually, no, I can go to my Facebook page. What am I thinking about? I was looking on my personal Facebook for a second. And if you're watching this on your computer, you can scan that with a QR code reader if you want. Uh, these images will be at the end of the video as well, just in, just in case. And if you scan that, of course, because as you can see, it says QR code right there. It'll give you those coordinates. And what those coordinates give you, see, I put them in to Google Maps. Hold on. See, put them into Google Maps. Right there, see Google Maps. If you zoom in all the way, this is what it says. Jesus loves you in the ground. And where this is near is, hold on. Let me just go back into Safari. This is near a Christian place, surprisingly. I don't know why, maybe it was um like a little nod towards something. But I mean, of course, it was it was based off Star Wars. If you've never seen the trailer, it it was in Mountain Meadow Christian Center, and the here's the building, right here, and then not not too far away from it, actually, if you're walking pretty far, is this. right here and of course if I click on it nothing appears if I want to do street view it says Google Maps could not determine your precise location so I don't know if they're from Switzerland by the way and this is in or no Idaho this is in Idaho so they must be doing their research and you know, putting it into a QR code. Wow. But yeah, now that I figured that out, because first of all, I thought it was Coffee Sin Studios. So, yeah, if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below if you want to see more. No, if you want to see more Goat Simulator or email me what you want me to do next. I may be able to hook up with Dead American Gamer again, and if you liked We Fluxed Up, we can do more of that. If you want, you know. So, subscribe if you're new, and may the odds be ever in your favor.